Les réserves navales ont participé à un exercice de défense côtière au large de l'ouest de l'île de Vancouver et dans le détroit de Juan de Fuca, le tout dirigé par le quartier général situé à NCSM Discovery. Saskatoon is taking part in exercise Pacific Guardian. Uh, we're one of uh, three maritime coastal defense vessels based in Esquimalt uh, and um, we're proceeding on a, one of our exercise taskings this morning uh, in support of uh, the RCMP, uh, which is a notional part of the exercise. Uh, the idea right now is the RCMP has asked us to search for a vessel that they're interested in taking a look at and possibly boarding for illegal contraband. Uh, so we're helping them with the surveillance and the intelligence portion, uh, giving them information about what's on the water. It's not every day uh, that we actually get to work with uh, international organizations and also certain exercises are not as common as others. So it gives us a wider opportunity to practice and hone skills that we don't get to use every day. Action stations, action stations. Go ahead! Clear! Post speed cover! Du 5 au 8 février, les marins ont été confrontés à divers scénarios reliés à la protection et à la défense des intérêts de la sécurité intérieure du Canada. When you're doing things in the classroom, of course, you lack that realism. When you're out at sea, when you're uh, tired or hungry or perhaps a little bit seasick, that realism kicks in and you're practicing uh, your skills under what it would be a little bit more stressful conditions. Le navire Wahoo et un hélicoptère, tous deux appartenant à la garde côtière américaine, ont contribué à un scénario d'évacuation de blessés durant un exercice destiné à renforcer la collaboration internationale interarmée. The learning uh, is enhanced by that environment. Uh, you're also working with a team organization with the ship under motion under real circumstances uh, where the ship's moving, rolling, perhaps it's dark, perhaps it's raining and you have to deal with those. Pour CFP Squamalt, enseigne de vaisseau deuxième classe, Delphine Bonardo.